continue to receive heartbeat tones, everything looks good. We're about 90 seconds from entry. Flight dynamics, EDL phase. Go ahead, phase. That last solution was with 227 or OD228? Uh, that is OD227. Thank you. You guys have now OD228 in your possession? Uh, there will be no 228 for us, phase. That's just fine because the difference is One minute entry. within spitting distance. Uh, affirmative. The vehicle will switch antenna shortly. We'll have a short dropout uh, when that occurs in the tones. Uh, it's switching to a tilted antenna that will be used through entry. We're switching the TLJ, signal dropped, and it's... We just saw the signal drop, that indicates we changed in tennis. We're, We're seeing heartbeat tones, tones again, again after the switch. Things are looking good. Uh, yeah, tones back again. Coming up on entry. Vehicle reports entry interface. At this time, it will begin pressurizing the propulsion system to increase the thrust of the system. Uh, we'll use that for all the maneuvering in the atmosphere we're about to do. Back to RP tones. We are standing by for guidance start and the start of guided entry. Nav can see the entering the atmosphere in the Doppler. We are beginning to feel the atmosphere uh, as we go in here. The vehicle is just reported via tones that it has started guided entry. way to the target. Uh, it is starting its first bank reversal. First bank reversal complete. We have seen peak deceleration. We have passed through peak heating and peak deceleration. Uh, it is reporting that we are seeing G's on the order of uh, 11 to 12 Earth G's. Flight, GDSA. GDSA, flight, go. We are processing data from Odyssey. Thank you, Russell. Two is starting. We are now getting telemetry from Odyssey. All bank right. reversal two complete. <laughs> Copy, bank reversal two complete. Thanks. Right. Standby flight. We have a connection, but we actually do not have any data yet. Copy. We can expect some intermittent contact at this time as the uh, signal gets there we increases go. to Universal respectable level. There we go. We are now seeing and we have on CDP. Okay, copy. To and visualization is updated. They've entered heading alignment. There it goes. At this time, Curiosity is no longer trying to control how far it's flying downrange and is just heading directly for the target. End of range control, air use minus 1.2 kilometers. 1.2. The EL team is reporting that uh, we are, uh, that things look pretty good at the end of range control. We have controlled, we have converged uh, a lot of the air and we should be heading toward the target. Fly EDL, uh, TDS warning is okay. Copy. Power and on. We are seeing a tone from the one uh, indicating that we uh, have seen uh, we have seen heating on the heat shield uh, through the medley instrument. Uh, everything looks fine. This is as expected. Uh, 
during the setting alignment phase, we're flying almost horizontally like a plane. We're going about Mach 2.4 at an altitude of 17 kilometers or so. Vehicles reporting heartbeat tones again, uh, indicating that everything is fine during heading alignments. Uh, we are standing by for straighten up and fly right and parachute deploy. Vehicles continuing to decelerate. We're down to about Mach 2. As a reminder, we should have parachute deploy around Mach 1.7. We're at 15 kilometers altitude. We've begun entry balance mass jettison. Predicted mid distance downrange is 1.597 kilometers. EDL Ops, Odyssey Systems on EDL Ops. Parachute deploy. Parachute. Yes. Thrusters have been re-enabled. Uh, we will control our attitude on shoot. We are decelerating. Wrist mode under our parachute. Our 10 kilometers accelerated and, and descending. We are at 150 per meters per second. Dynamics phase. Come back again with uh, wrist mode dynamics. Wrist mode is nominal. We are Blood 9 kilometers up. and Eight descending. Eight minutes active. Valid range. Net filter converged with a velocity correction of 0. 0.7 meters a second. We have acquired the ground with the radar. An altitude of 8 kilometers. Speech has separated, separated where we, we found the ground. expand tones due to earth occultation as expected. We're standing by to prime the MLE engines in preparation for powered flight. We're down to 90 meters per second at an altitude of 6.5 kilometers and descending. Flight EDL, we've got some Tweeta warnings. It is we in battle short mode, so I should power through them. Director Earth Communications at this time. We may have lost it already. We're down to 86 meters per second at an altitude of 4 kilometers and descending. We have lost, we have lost tones from Earth at this time. This is expected. Uh, we are continuing on Odyssey telemetry. Ground solution equals minus 10.8 meters, vertical velocity of minus 82.8 meters per second. Start enabled, standing by for batch shell separation. Signal Odyssey is still strong. We are in powered flight. Yes. We're at an altitude of one kilometer descending, about 70 meters per second. Signal to Down to 50 meters per second. 500 meters in altitude. Standing by for sky crane. Constant velocity accordion nominal. Altitude error 5.9 meters. We found a nice flat place. We're coming in ready for sky crane. Down to 10 meters per second. 40 meters altitude. Sky crane has started. Descending at about 0.75 meters per second as expected. Expecting bridal cut shortly. Tango to us, you remain strong. Tango Delta nominal. Yeah, uh, Ram you stable. Ram you stable. UHF is good. Touchdown confirmed. We're safe yeah! on Mars. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Time to see where our curiosity will take us.